All right, so you're in the market for an impact gun like this one to remove lug nuts or whatever you need to use it for, but you're not sure if a small compressor like this six gallon can handle it. Well, long story short, you're probably gonna be just fine. There's two things to look at. Let me explain it to you. Now, every air tool you buy is gonna have something called SCFM requirements, which stands for square cubic feet per minute. It's basically a measurement of airflow that your air compressor can produce. But you use air impact wrenches in short bursts. So what you really wanna look at is the minimum air requirements to go into your tool and to see if your compressor can handle it. So this impact gun requires 90 PSI going into the tool for this to operate at full capacity. So although this is only a small six gallon compressor, it also packs 150 PSI in this tank. So you should be able to use an impact for short bursts without an issue. Again, ignore the SCFM rating. All you need is to make sure you always have 90 PSI going into the tool and it'll operate the way it's supposed to. I'll show you. My test subject is a Jeep Grand Cherokee and I have all the lugs tightened down to 110 pound feet. So as you can see, we have 150 pounds in the tank and I had the regulator set to 90. Well, we'll see if we can remove a couple lug nuts before it drops below 90 PSI. Now that was the lowest torque setting on this impact gun. I was able to get two lugs off before this even got below 100. So we'll turn this up to three. We'll tighten these lugs back up. Oh, we'll give it a whirl on setting three. So I was able to get three lug nuts off with the level three setting on this impact before this guy got below 90 PSI. It's pretty awesome. And the recovery time on these small six gallon compressors are typically pretty good. So you only have to wait about 20 seconds longer before it gets back up to full capacity. So there you have it guys. You wanna run an impact, but you don't wanna spend the money on a big compressor? No worries. Six gallons should do you just fine. Thank you guys for watching.